What's up, my Spamonies? It's your girl, Bubbles, coming back with another episode of Rags to Riches. On the last episode, Lilith got a secret husband. Got married. A secret marriage husband. Lilith is married to a man that we've never met. So, <laughs> we're gonna have to fix that today. We also renewed our vows between Shane and Heather, which was very romantic, and it was done at the romance festival. You could not ask for a better scene. We did have some drama because don't we always? If you'd like to watch what happened last week, you can see all of the episodes that we've done so far right on my page below. Remember, if you like this video, to please give it a big thumbs up and share and comment and subscribe. It sounds like a lot. It's not that much, I promise. Anyway, let's play some Sims. Lilith had a secret marriage to Gunther Munch. I went ahead and moved them into this house. I thought that we could take Heather and Shane to go visit them today. And Heather can confront Lilith about not being invited to the wedding. We will be the welcome wagon. It's Sunday evening. Everyone looks like they're in a pretty good mood. I'm not really sure why everybody's standing outside. Oh, I took photos. I know I forgot the last video to do this. So we have some cute photos. We have little Gretchen and Audrey and mom and dad. They're so cute. And then Audrey and Gretchen together. Oh, I need one of swipes. What is my problem? How could I forget swipey? We're gonna do that right now. <laughs> right through Heather's legs. Oh my gosh, that's kind of amazing. I get what she's going for, you know. She's taking some artistic liberties. Okay, well, this works. At least we'll have a picture on the wall now. All right, Heather needs to do some programming. Shane's taking Gretchen to go get some food in the high chair. Wow, we love to see it. And Gretchen just ate sugar. Great job, dad. What did you give her? Oh yeah, and here's the pictures of Shane and Heather from the romance festival. I don't wanna put them on the same wall. I wanna put them somewhere else. Maybe we'll do three of them next to this mirror and we'll do them all white. She wants her mom. Shane, why don't you let her out? Probably put her to bed. It's pretty late. Read her to sleep. Such a cute interaction. Cute. Wait, is it cute? Little father-daughter bonding time. Heather's a little hungry and tired. She can stop working on that for now. I would like to have her paint one painting before she goes to bed. And tomorrow we'll go to work and then go to Lilith. So bombard Lilith with friendship. Like, hi, so you called me to ask if you should have a baby. I would like to meet the man with whom you'd be having this baby with, Lilith. I'd be pissed if my friend got secretly married and didn't tell me and then just called and asked if they should have a baby. Like, what? Nope, don't wash that. We're gonna sell it for monies. $50, damn. That's some good stuff. Okay, all's well in the steel is a lot household. Audrey's up first. Oh, she's very hungry. All right, kitten. <coughs> Come down and get some breakfast. Gretchen's not tired anymore. Wake up. Come downstairs. That'll work on your movement and then work on your imagination. Oh my goodness. She's gonna age up today, I think. Gretchen, are you ready to be a big kid? Look at her walking. She's so good at it. Oh, she did a little stumble. Mom's coming down. She's gonna greet swipes in the morning. Hello, my little ghost kitty. Shane can work from home today. What does he have to do? Plan agenda for faculty meeting. That's something new. Bye, Audrey. Have a good day at school. Audrey, completing school projects really has a positive impact on your grades. Keep up a good work. Gretchen is so close to maxing out her imagination. Yes! She can now view art. Okay, we gotta get our movement up. She's listening to dad. What is dad doing? Oh, they're gonna hug. Aww. Heather goes to work in 45 minutes and she should definitely get promoted today. We found an unsent love letter from Audrey to her teacher in her desk today. Nothing racy, but we thought you should know. Say cute, but inappropriate, we'll talk. Yes, that's my girl. Good job. You are ready to become a child. So proud of you. Now you can just do whatever you want. I guess when Heather comes home, we'll have a little birthday party for Gretchen and then go over to Lilith's. Audrey's home with a school project. She's very tense. How many more projects does she have to do? Let's do something that will make her less tense. Let's have her play some video games. Play with your new friends and Lilith. Audrey, did you finish your homework? Finish your homework. Mom, do a little bit more work. We'll have the birthday party and then we'll go to Lilith's. How's mom doing on her aspiration? We're gonna get there, I believe in us. 
Add those birthday candles for little Gretchy. It's birthday time. Gretchen aged up. I handpicked Audrey's, but I want to randomize Gretchen's because I feel like she's a lot different than Audrey, but I don't know how. So I kind of want to see what the game says. So let's hit randomize. She's self-assured. I love that for her. Pick a number between one and four. Two. Oh, mental. Oh, so she's going to be really smart. Oh, maybe what we can do is bring the birthday cake over to Lilith's and eat it there. But first, we must do a makeover. She looks so grown up already. I'm loving the brown hair on her and the curly hair, but I don't really like this hair. It just looks very uptight. <laughs> and she's a young, cute kid, a genius, and she's self-assured. Let's make her look like it. our girl let's go over to Lilith's house okay we're here and I built this house here's the front I used some CC tile that I got can she not knock on the door oh did they make the back door the front door well friends go through the back door right well let's introduce ourselves to Gunther she's like hello oh we didn't change our clothes let's do that now she's like hello I am Lilith's best friend and I've literally never met you before and now you're married Dad, come meet Gunther Munch so you can ask for a donation. Where the heck is Lilith? She must be at work. Gretchen, do not sleep in the hot tub. Oh my gosh, there's a werewolf running around. What the heck is going on? This was a bad idea. I just wanted to bring them cake. Actually, let's have some cake. Can everybody come eat the cake, please? Is he gonna have some cake? No, he's gonna go to bed. This is a very weird visit. No, oh, mom, you're not gonna take a bubble bath. All right, we're going home. That didn't go as planned, but at least we left Lilith some cake. Oh, look, and Malcolm Landgrab is here. Our BFF. All right, talk to Malcolm. Enthuse about cooking. Be like, I made a great apple pie. Would you like some? I make a hell of a gumbo. You want some omelets or clam chowder? He's like, look at all this food that I make. Wow, he gave us another donation. That was the second one. He's, he's good for a land grab. I mean, I don't know the lore. But in this game, he's a good guy. He's looking at the grave. Where's Swipes? There he is. Go scare Malcolm. Be like, I'm not dead, see? <laughs> now that the kids are older, we have two child age kids. They're going to need more room. I think I need to get out of build mode now before I spend every dime we have. Look at our new giant house. Whoa, it's so big. That's what she said. I love it. Her and Shane are still feeling really flirty. Don't get any ideas, guys. We're not having another baby. It's not happening. I'm putting my foot down. Oh, he's very close to level seven debate. Come on, you got this, Shane. You got this. Yay, you did it. Excellent. Go to sleep. 
Oh my gosh, Shane got promoted again already before work. Now he's the director of academics. It's Gretchen's first day of school. Study hard. Wow, looking schnazzy. <laughs> work time. Go to work, Heather. Go get promoted. Yay, they're home from school. Should Audrey invite over class media? Okay, yeah, invite her over. Heather got promoted to dot com pioneer. Come talk to Lilith. You gotta be friends with her. <gasps> no, why would you do that? Girl, are you psycho? Are you a psycho? Because let me tell you, that is something that a psycho does. You're a psycho. I hope you feel better. You should yell at Lilith. Be like, why the heck did you do that? You can't because I want you to be friends. Aw, at least she's feeling better now. Mom, I think that you should probably offer everyone some apple pie. Here, we'll have like a little potluck leftover celebration station. Okay, Audrey, let's do this. Let's do this. Talk to Mitchell. This is Uncle Mitchell. You've met him a million times. You got this, Audrey. You got this. <gasps> yes! We did it! Oh my goodness. I can't believe we're gonna age Audrey up into a teen. I am very excited. All right, you know what that means. It's birthday party time. Audrey just achieved her childhood dream of becoming very popular, socially gifted, and she'll build soldier, social skills faster. She should invite her teen friend, Devin Pancakes. Yes, let's hire a mixologist for the adults. They can party. And we're gonna have it at our house, as always, because we have the greatest house. All right, Shane, what kind of cake are you gonna make? We can do this blue confetti cake. Look at Audrey in her cute outfit. Where's Gretchen's party outfit? They kind of match. And I love that. And she likes video gaming. Audrey, go talk to Devin. Why is Devin scared? Is it because of the ghost cat? Is she scared of our little ghost cat? Don't be scared. Let's turn on some music. There we go. Now it's a party. Okay, everyone has to come here. It's time to sing to the birthday girl. Oh, everybody's going outside to react to the snow first. That's cute. Here we go, Audrey. Make a wish. Yay! Oh, look at her sister there cheering her on. <gasps> Audrey aged up. Teenaged him. Romantic travels, sweaty gym shorts, and hormonal upheavals await. Best buckle those boots. The ride starts here. Let's see what the game comes up with and see if I agree. An insider. These sims love being in clubs and tend to be happiest when surrounded by their friends. Oh, that tracks. That totally tracks. She always was very creative. Maybe she'd want to be a painter like her mom. Wow, she looks so different. Okay, you know what time it is. Makeover time. Oh, I'm so excited for this one because now we get to give her skin details and like cute party looks. I kind of wanted to make her look like a stereotypical popular girl just because that is what she is. She's popular. Oh, I like this hair on her actually a lot. And we can soften it up a little. I can't believe I'm not giving her alpha CC hair, but I really love this look on her. And I never use this hair, so this is what we're gonna do. And now we gotta do some skin details. She's so cute. And she does look like mom and dad put together. That's like a little bit of Shane, a little bit of mom. I need to get to her eyebrows, but the hair's not letting me. There we go. Okay, cute. Now let's give her some earrings. Like how does she already look so grown up? There's a cute choker from high school years. Yes, this. That is giving me like teen vibes. Yeah, I kind of like that for her. believe that she's a teen. I think this is a good place to stop for the day. And we got a lot done today. We expanded the house, which I really was not planning on doing, but I'm glad that we did do it. And I think it looks great. I'm really happy with how it came out. Remember, if you like this video to please give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. It really helps me out and it helps me be able to keep making more videos like this. Also comment below. Let me know what you think. I love to hear from you. And until then, I will see you next time. Love ya.